everybody. This is we from Mama Bui's Kitchen. I hope you are having a great day. This week, guys, we will be making Chinese restaurant style dishes. We picked items from the buffet so we can try to make them, guys. <laughs> I hope we do them right and I hope you will enjoy them. The items we picked is sweet and sour chicken. We also picked fried rice. Um, the other one is crab rangoon. We picked um, chicken and broccoli stir fries, sweet and sour sauce, garlic green beans, and duck sauce. So today, guys, we are going to make delicious and healthy Chinese chicken and broccoli stir fry. Guys, this dish tastes like something you would order at a Chinese restaurant, except it's better for you and cheaper. So guys, let's get started. You know, Mama we doesn't like to waste time. First things first, we're going to start by prepping the chicken and the vegetables before we start. With this recipe, we are going to use chicken breast. Cut the chicken in half lengthwise and slice about one inch thick bite sized pieces against the grain. Transfer the chicken into a medium bowl. Now we're gonna start marinating our chicken. Add cornstarch. In goes a little bit of egg white soy sauce rice wine vinegar mix that up make sure that every piece is coated nicely keep massaging it for another five minutes until you can feel that the chicken has a velvety texture allow it to marinate for 20 minutes in a refrigerator while we are prepping our veggies next we're gonna cut the carrots on diagonal so each is about half inch at the widest part make sure your carrots are cut into uniformly sized pieces so that they cook at the same rate i forgot to mention that you have to peel them before you cut them guys once done set them aside next Cut the broccoli florets into bite-sized pieces, then set aside. Next, hold a piece of ginger root firmly in one hand. Scrape the edge of the spoon against ginger to peel off the skin, then slice the peeled area of ginger root across fibers into coins stack two or three coins of ginger root at a time cut them into matchsticks then crosswise cuts that's how you mince the ginger once done set aside next we're gonna cut fresh garlic into thin slices then use a fan chop technique to mince our veggies are prepped now it's time to put everything together here in my wok i have my water boiling i'm gonna add about one tablespoon of salt add carrots i'm gonna let them blanch for about 20 seconds then remove them and put them in a cold water bath Next, we're going to blanch the broccoli florets for about 45 seconds, then remove them also and place them in a cold water bath. Next, we are going to make sauce. Here in my bowl, I have about one cup of chicken stock in that i'm gonna add hoisin sauce oyster sauce i'm gonna go in with soy sauce rice wine vinegar minced ginger and minced garlic 
Mix that up, then set aside. Back to the stove, I'm adding in the chicken in the boiling water. I'm going to move it around once or twice so it doesn't stick together. This method of cooking, guys, is called water velveting. This will get our chicken silky coating, soft and juicy. Cook the chicken for two to three minutes, then remove the chicken and put it to the side. Next, get the wok going over high heat, add the sauce and bring it to a boil. Let it simmer for about one minute, then add the carrots, broccoli and the chicken. Stir and let it simmer for 30 seconds. Next, add the slurry to thicken the sauce. It should take about 15 seconds for everything to come together. Toss everything together and take it to see if you need more salt. Check the consistency of the sauce. When you see every piece of chicken and broccoli is coated nicely, the sauce is slightly thick, you can take it out. There you have it guys, chicken and broccoli stir fry. Skip the takeout and make this Chinese chicken and broccoli at home. It's easier to make than you might think and taste even better than your local restaurant i hope you enjoyed this video guys share it with your friends and your family i want to hear your thoughts about this dish guys leave a comment down below i love hearing from you guys thanks for watching until next time guys bye honey for my heart